action. <laughs> Welcome to my channel. I'm gonna be doing my February hauls. Um, I have a lot of clothes and some random miscellaneous things, so I guess we should get started. This is my first haul, so I don't know. If I sound like I don't know what I'm doing, probably because I really don't. But yeah, hope you guys enjoy, and let's get started. Let's start with Zara. I feel like that's probably the most interesting. Um, picked up two shirts this February and it is this light pink. Oh god, that looks really bad on camera. It's a light pink shirt. It says La Vie and Rose and it's just really big. It's it, there's only it comes in one size, so it's huge. Yay. And um I just I I'm, I'm a huge t-shirt person. I wear t-shirts every day 90% of the time. Another t-shirt I picked up is going to be the it's like a raglan. It's just like a baseball tee. Um it's just plain orange sleeve um, and then I think in the beginning of the month or at the beginning of the year they had a huge sale and I didn't really find anything I liked but in February I went to a store and they actually had these on sale Generally, I think they're like 90 or 80 but I got them for 70 and then the second one I got is I was actually eyeing these since maybe December and they were I think they were like 180 almost 200 and I was like that's so expensive like I can't I can't afford that and I probably wouldn't use it as much as I thought I would but um, they went on sale for 90 or 80 gosh I'm so sorry I should write these down but yeah it was 80 I think or 90 85 we'll go with 85 and they're just like the combat boots they had like the studying detail um, there's a strap right here in the middle and I don't it's not really fun it doesn't really function it doesn't do anything so it doesn't yeah it doesn't do anything um, there's like laces and I don't really know what I'm supposed to do with the laces but and so that's all for Zara not too many things for February um, okay so then let's move on to Forever 21 and I usually do buy a good amount of stuff on Forever 21 but surprisingly I did not this month um, I don't really know why but what I did pick up were just these boyfriend pants Um, let me just cuff them at the end, but they're destroyed really, really well, I guess you can say. A lot of the ones I find out for 21, they are not, they look cheap, but I felt like this wash was actually not bad. They kind of remind me of the ASOS boyfriend jeans. Uh, my sister has those, so they kind of were similar, so pick these up. This was 35 um, so I picked up one thing, oh actually no, and then I picked up these from Forever 21. These are the... They kind of look like the Giuseppe Zanotti heels. I already have a pair that look really similar to this, but I don't know, I just picked it up again because I felt like I needed them and I only wore them once in February and they're for a wedding. And they're actually pretty comfortable, they really are. They're a lot more comfortable than I thought they would be, so definitely like the depends on how you like it. Zipper in the back. And yeah, they're not too high. Um, they're not bad, I guess, so that is this. And so that was Forever 21. Uh, we'll move on to 2020 Avenue. And I bought a couple things, but I ended up returning them because the sizing was a little off. But I did keep one thing, and um, it's really cute. And I think I've actually seen this on Nasty Gal for like $70, but on um, 2020 Avenue, it was only $30. Kind of like a lace camisole dress. Yeah, it's a dress, so... Um, yeah, it's really like delicate. It has really cute lacing detail on the straps. I feel like it might like rip, but it seems kind of sturdy. So I don't know. Um, yeah, so then this is really nice. In the back, it has an adjustable. So um, you kind of like tie it and you can kind of like make it as long or short. So that's really cool. I know they have like... Pretty good sales and coupons sometimes, like on Retail Me Not. So definitely check that out. I think I got 10% off when I checked on Retail Me Not. They have like a coupon for it. So um, if I do find one, I'll link it in the information box below as well. And then I picked up one thing from H&M. And it's just a really soft, I think it's just what? Probably just like polyester, but it's really soft. And um, it's, just like, it's just like a long sleeve, doesn't have a collar. 
Um, if you look at, at it really like closely, it has like spots or dots. Next, we will go into Nordstrom Rack. Um, I got these faux leather shorts. I already have like a ton of these. I really cheap. It's only $18.97. So these are actually really soft and comfortable. And this is an extra small. They have a but yeah, they I like that they have a huge array of sizes, so kind of works out. So these are cool. Um, nothing crazy. And then I picked up two striped shirts. This one is Calvin Klein. Um, this was originally, I think it was like $65. I don't know why. But I found it in the sale for, um, I think it was like $18. Um, it's just like a light khaki beige striped shirt. Um, I got it in, they had a bunch of sizes again, but I got it in medium because I really like my t-shirts really loose. And another one, plain black one stripe. Um, so it's not really like anything special. But yeah, I got this one in a small, it came in an extra small, but I got it in a small because I wanted it really big. It looks really big. Like this is huge, look at that, it's like two times of me. But yeah, I wanted it big so that um, it's more comfortable. <laughs> I'm all about comfort. I picked up two sunglasses and one of them is the Kohan Sunnies. They're pretty cool. Like, okay, there's like a big sticker on it, but they're kind of like Ray-Bans slash Karen Walker. Um, yeah, because like, you know, Karen Walker has that arrow on the side, so that kind of reminded me of that. Um, these are really cheap. These are only $16.99, so I am really happy about that. And it is the tortoise colored. Yep. So the second thing I picked up is going to be the Long Bon sunglasses. Um, they're really cute. I actually saw these online for $650. And these were $150 at Nordstrom. There's like this gold inside ring that kind of shadows. And it's actually really cool. It's totally different than what I've ever seen. I've never thought of even people putting like a gold border around your sunglass but kind of work the only thing that i was sad about was that they didn't have the case and i'm like you can't sell me something without the case like that doesn't make any sense but uh they just gave me like this pink kate spade case and i was just like i like pink i guess i'll take it finally the last couple things we have are sneakers um i'm a huge sneaker person i would actually prefer sneakers than heels i picked up these adidas tech super and I really like them. They're so cute. Um, I love that there's pink on the inside and there's like a pink um, like detailing here and like even on the stripe if you can tell. And it's just like, it kind of like has like a zebra-y effect, but it's not. I mean, they're just stripes that are not uniform. And then there's like a mesh. And oh God, I would probably wear them like every day, but they don't fit me. They're a size six and I am a five and a half. And I mean, no, I can wear six in maybe like heels. Like these are ones were six. But I mean, tennis shoes, they got to fit you pretty well and snug. And these do not. So I'm um, really sad about that. It's actually, I posted it on my Poshmark. And um, maybe it'll sell there. But if not, then i just put these in my shoe closet and stare at them. Bye bye, shoe. Last few things um, is my love for food box. This is my first month that I got it. It was the month of February, so I got a I found a discount on Retail Me Not, so I only paid five dollars for my first box. But after that, it's twelve dollars. There's just like it's like organic, no GMOs. Um, I don't know if it's necessarily healthy because there's like chocolate and things, but it's still I guess like if you're gonna munch, maybe it's better to munch on something organic. Oh, obviously. So then there's like olives and chips and my favorite is like chocolate <laughs> they have like a bunch of like chocolate bars so um i think it'll be interesting i think i'm only gonna do it for a couple months see if i like it and if i even eat it and i guess i'll if you guys are interested i'll be posted on this love with food box i'm a huge foodie so kind of makes sense that i would do that instead of makeup <laughs> all right um coming down to the last few things is gonna be beauty related um i only have like four products to show so um, it is the Natural 120 Demi um, All Black Fake Eyelashes. 
Um, these are the ones I usually wear. I don't really, I'm not wearing anything right now, so. Um, these are the ones I usually buy, and they are $2.99 at Ulta, but if you go to like Sally's, they're like $6.99 or $7.99. They're outrageously expensive, so I definitely recommend going to Ulta if you like these. This is the um, Kim Kardashian Cabana Bronzer. I don't like orange on my cheeks. I don't know if it's kind of coming out orange, but I'm wearing it today. And it is the Cabana Bronzer. And I like the packaging. It's like rose gold. How cute is that? Yeah. But it's nice packaging. Um, it doesn't look so shimmery. Maybe it has like a nice sheen, but there's no like glitter. And that's a huge thing. I don't want glitter in my bronzer. No, I'm wearing it now. Works. Oh, so, $15 at Ulta if you're interested. I will put all these information below. I also got a Maybelline Dream Lumi Touch Concealer. Highlighter concealer. So, wearing it as well right like here and on my nose and some here and here and here. I don't know. I can tell the difference. I can't really either, but... Oh, and the color is in Nude. And last but not least, oh my god, we made it through my first haul. How fun and exciting. Okay, at least for me. Um, I picked up a Revlon Super Lustrous Lipstick in Black Cherry for $77. And I picked this up because it is like the media dupe. I like the packaging. It's like gold and black. And um, yeah, so it looks really dark. It is dark. So um, that's kind of... It'll be interesting. I don't wear too much lip color. The most I do is like pink, which is what I'm wearing now. I'm wearing Primrose with, by Revlon. Okay, so that's the end of the haul. Um, my first haul, I hope I did okay. And um, of course, I have a blog. And if you guys are interested, you can follow me there. My blog is um, www.spreadfashion.com. And I do have an Instagram, and that is Spread Fashion. And you can follow me there as well. So I um, hope to talk to you guys soon. And thanks for watching. Bye-bye. Bye-bye. Bye-bye.